In this video, we're going to group the reinforcements together. Since the transverse reinforcement and the longitudinal reinforcements were modeled separately, they have to be grouped together as one part list. This is done to ensure that perfect bonding is established between the concrete and reinforcement subsequently. To create a part list, under the finite element menu, select model and part and then keyword manager. Note that this can also be selected by just coming to the right dot menu and then clicking on keyword manager over here. To create a part list, make sure all is selected and then in the edit text box search for set. Scroll down under the set key card until you find part list. Double click on the part list key card. Click on a new ID to set the set ID to one. For the title, type in reinforcement set. Set the part ID one to transverse reinforcement and part ID two to longitudinal reinforcement. Click in set to add it to the part, the set data, and then click on a set, and then done. Save. This step ensures that the reinforcement is grouped together, so that subsequently, the reinforcement can be bonded to the concrete. 